YouTube, what is the deal, man? It's your boy, The Truth Dick, and you see the hack, so you know what it is. The long-awaited Broncos theme team update with this man, Brandon Marshall. I obviously got him last week from the Veterans promo. Um, I actually sucked with this in terms of keeping up with my wildcard Wednesday solos. I was one short, so even though today is the last wildcard Wednesday, I had to actually go out and buy them. Couldn't retain them by, by the solos, but nevertheless... This is a golden ticket, fellas. This is our second golden ticket. If you obviously watched the series in terms of the Broncos theme team, I mentioned Patrick Sertain when he got his team of the year and we all the boosts and stuff. It was a golden ticket. This is a golden ticket. I mean, look at, compare this to most golden ticket receivers. You're not going to find nothing better stat-wise. The only reason he wouldn't be considered a golden ticket is because of his ability buckets, and he's a physical receiver, and physical receivers get the worst attributes or abilities in the game. But, I mean, look at the everything on the board is 99 except catching traffic and short route running, which... It's crazy because Brandon Marshall was known for um, catching in traffic, but agility is great, um, speed, awareness. He has a, even has a great run block at 95, which is some of the one of the main key stats that separates golden ticket receivers from non-golden ticket receivers. So 98 truck and 97 change of direction. I mean, he's fantastic, man. He's absolutely fantastic. Um, we're running route tech and deep out elite on him. And big announcement, this will probably be one of the last time you guys see a gameplay for me caught you then not in terms of madden but gameplay in terms of madden 22 on a current gen or old gen whatever it may be as of june 1st i will be transitioning to next gen full time now if you guys know my story just a quick breakdown i started on next gen the beginning of the year but then i got console banned for no apparent reason which a lot of people obviously got banned too this past weekend but my ban was more than an account ban it was a console ban so i had to go back to my ps4 it was on ps4 until about the middle of march um, so once obviously that came to fruition, it was already deep into current gen. So I stayed on it and played weekend league, but don't think I'm going to be playing much weekend league the last couple months. I will be still playing games, but even more head to head, but I want to get used to playing current or next gen, excuse me, heading into Madden 23. Um, so this is the offense. It's the same. We did boost up our strategy cards, which you guys didn't know with the season changeover, you were able to boost them up even more. So we boosted up our arm wall and our mind reader. And if you've seen our offensive line, um, they're a little bit more boosted. Obviously, Tony Vaselli, Saffro, Matt Paradis, Max Garcia, and Bobby Massey all are respectively at least a 96 overall. But nothing else has changed. Just Brandon Marshall. Just waiting on that Russell Wilson golden ticket, and we'll add him to the squad. Um, and also, we do have Tony Castillas here. Um, obviously, he gets on Team Kim's. That'll be a good addition because we haven't had a D tackle all year. But that's the squad. Let's get into it. Let's see if we can make something happen. All right. So this is my opponent. Looks like you got the new Tom Brady. Um, from the solos, and this is our top three Broncos Nation. Win, lose, or draw, we feeding Brandon Marshall. Let's get it. All right, first and ten. It looks like my opponent is in in, in his divisional round. Um, it looks like he's going to come out in some man to man, which is going to be interesting to do. Brandon Marshall is going to cook that man to man though. Brandon Marshall, first play. Let's go crazy. Oh, click on, bro. Let me get sticky. Big play, Brandon Marshall. So my guy is exclusively staying in man-to-man -man defense, and he's going to try to get pressure with three. So we're going to try to feed Melvin Gordon here. Melvin should get open. Oh, no, oh, Vernon Davis. Vernon, Vernon. Touchdown, touchdown. Not Brandon Marshall, but probably our best weapon, Vernon Davis. 7-0. Let's get on defense. My opponent is a scumbag, and he field goal block glitch me. So that's why it's 6-2 instead of a... Uh, that should be a pick. Oh my God, it's not Patrick Sertain. Getting an eight, like I shouldn't have to go for two every time. Like that should not be an, a requirement for me to do. He's going play action, yep. Let me get that. Justin Simmons, best hands in the league. Okay, let's get out of there. Let's get out of there. Stay up, Justin. Justin Simmons. Let's get back on offense, baby. My guy is gonna stick to this man to man. He really is, so I guess we're just gonna have to cook. We're just going to have to cook. So we're going to, um, like I said, we're just going to have to cook. We're just going to have to cook. We're just going to have to cook. He's going to learn his lesson to get out of this. He is. Again, sticking to the man, the man. So we're not going to do anything different. Except this time we're going to have Vernon. Nope, we're going to have Brandon. We're going to have Brandon. One, two combo. Brandon Marshall, Vernon Davis. Brandon Marshall, Vernon Davis. Oh, I guess if it's not broke, don't fix it. Um, We're going to go... Back to Brandon Marshall, I mean, um, Vernon Davis and Melvin Gordon combo. And we have Melvin Gordon now. We have Melvin Gordon now. We have Melvin Gordon now. Touchdown. 
touchdown, touchdown. And he's out of here, man. He's out of here. You can't even play man to man the whole game. You can't. You just can't do it, bro. All right, on to game number two. Um, my boy got Ben DiNucci go to ticket. I heard mixed feelings about him, but you know our top three. It ain't changed, but it's my first time facing Ben DiNucci. So, I mean, we got to spoil it, so let's make it happen. Be Marsh, baby. Okay. All right. Rich Allen 119. Apparently, my last opponent didn't want to play. Um, don't know. Got kicked off any quick. Maybe that Brandon Marshall beast just scared him. Probably was scared me. <laughs> just playing. Let's get it. All right. First and 10 for my opponent. He's in single back. Bunch. Um, haven't seen this in a while, but. So he motions out Keenan. He looks like Keenan now and Ver Vernon Davis. He got Vernon Davis at the slot receiver. I assume with the route tech, so we'll take that. Oh, we hit ourselves. Oh, oh, he getting sticky with it. Okay, okay. All right, he's going back to that. What we're gonna do though, we're gonna put Cam in a hard flat on the right side to kind of stop that drag with um Kyle Pitts if it's still there, which it is. Yep. Yeah. Oh my, what a route! Jesus. Okay. All right. That was an amazing route. Let me get that. Thank you. Can't run it two times in a row, my boy. Appreciate the rock, though. All right. First and 10. Looks like it's just standard stock cover three, which it is. We will take Brandon Marshall on the slot, meaning the flat. Go crazy. We pick up 19. Let's get it. I don't know if he audible to a cover two or I think he did. We'll take Brandon Marsh in the slot, though. Go crazy. All right. He did audible to a cover two. He did audible to a cover two here. I'm going to try to hit. Oh, Brandon Marsh was out of the game. I guess we're going to try to hit. Uh, no fan of the scene. All right. All right. Let Russ cook. Not entirely sure why Brandon Marshall was super tired there, but um, let's see if he's on. He is on Cam Chancellor. We got that out route to Brandon Marshall. Yes, sir. Can't just run stock coverage against me. Um, I will pick it apart, just being honest. So he's sitting on, I don't know who that is, but Jimmy Graham, I think. We'll take Brandon Marsh underneath. He's going to try to hit stick me. Nope. You don't take those hits, baby. So he's staying in cover two. Um, I think he's, I don't know exactly who he's on. Yeah, he's on Patrick Sertain. We're going to try to hit Brandon. Woo -hoo -hoo! What a laser, absolutely laser beam. Let's go. All right, we're back on defense. I threw a bit of a lag spike from my opponent. Um, I don't know what he's running, so we'll take that, yep. Clamps, Randy Gregory. I need to see it this season, son. All right, we're back on, we'll take that. Oh! And that, my friends, is Acrobat gone wrong. <laughs> when you try to make a play with Acrobat, and it does not allow you to. So we're going to go, yeah. That's a good cover three beater. That's a real good cover three beater. Didn't expect it. GG's. Well, on the drive. But we should have had a pick, but it is what it is. Back on offense. All right, first and ten. He is... Technically in the 4-3 against me, which when people in the 4-3 against me, I absolutely toast it. I absolutely toast it. See ya. <laughs> absolutely toast it. That's or 3-4, sorry, not the 4-3. Which is interesting. Um that he went to that concept of a 4-3. Oh my god, he gets pressure. Okay, good play. Good play. It's all right. Gives me more room to operate. Calls a timeout. Second and go. Um, he's guarding that over there. I know he is, but he's not guarding Vernon. Yeah. Touchdown. He was so worried about the corner with his user 
that if you got the guard in the middle with Vernon Davis, one two combo, they're deadly. I like Ver uh, Luke Keekley in that hook. Um, let's see what defense. Let's see if he goes Keenan Allen on a corner route. Not if he does not. No. Oh, good D. I was trying to bait that, but obviously got a little late. I was able to knock it out though. He's gonna stick to this, so we're gonna stick to our defense, our offense. No, no, we're there, we're there. Someone go get him. No. Good play. Then with an audible real quick, he wasn't expecting it. Yup. That should be a pick. Should be a pitch. Patrick Sertain, PS2. Can we get to the crib? Can we get to the crib? Can we spin him out? PS2. He's about to join the upper echelon of receivers next year. Or corner, sorry. Locking down receivers. And he's out of here. That ends it. Let's go. Successful gameplay. 3-0. and All right, that's going to be it for me. As you see, Brandon Marshall is a monster. Obviously, Russ made some great throws. Brandon Marshall shined, so... Next upgrade you guys will see from me will probably be Russell Wilson. I got a kind of an idea of a series I want to do with the Broncos theme team. Um, I want to wait till I get Russell Wilson. Kind of we have our max team in terms of upgrades. And I'll bring it to you guys with the Broncos theme team. And like I said, next time you guys probably see me, we'll be back on next gen. Absolutely, we'll be back on next gen because I want to prepare myself for Madden 23. But Brandon Marshall is a dog. Absolutely a dog. It's kind of crazy. He got a veterans card instead of an ultimate legend. But nevertheless, it works for me. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Until next time, I will see y'all. You know I'm going that mile hot salute. Did with both hands that time, but deuces.